going on gamers? Welcome back to another Madden 20 tip video. Today we're going to go over two key things to be able to shut down the run in Madden 20. I already gave one of these tips away to my Patreon, but the link in the description has everything that you need to be able to stay up to date. And the Patreon members, be patient. I got a lot of fire coming for y'all, man. I appreciate all the love and support. Y'all been very patient this year. Y'all can see the updated channel. We got the face cam going on. We got the upgraded microphone. We got some live gameplay, live tips, live streams coming at y'all full speed, man. I hope y'all ready. So we're going to go on the defensive side. What I like to do is the 3-4 bear and the 3-4 I, but it's some key things that you can do if your opponent is running, running, running. Now, in my audibles, I like to send, I like to set up pinch Mike O. And then in my audibles, I like to set up pinch Buck O. Two glitchy defenses, but it's gonna help you out tremendously, especially if you have pretty decent cornerbacks. So first in the pinch Mike O, we're just gonna do random run. So we don't know what kind of run he's gonna do. So what I'm gonna do, the first biggest tip is, I'm gonna press shade outside, shade over the top, take this guy right here and pull him outside of that receiver. Now, with this type of setup, I would uh, shift my line to the left. Now, if you think that it's a run, say they ran two or three times, push wire triangle and then go to individual, put the running back and spotlight him. You see how the circle goes underneath him? That's just gonna make everything real aggressive. Now in this situation, I wanna use this guy on the tight end. If he runs it, I don't wanna come down here and get picked up. So he is on the running back. I want him to be able to shoot the gap and I wanna be able to come in for the cleanup behind it. So we're gonna stay right here, let him run the play. There's the run, he does a trap, and our backside help gets him. We're gonna bring him even. I'm gonna shift my line and we all set. Now you can go and highlight him if you want to, but you just wanna make sure everybody is keyed on him. As you can see, that guy comes free off the edge. Not too many people run counters, so that's not something that you really have to worry about. So you can also shift into the pinch buckle like this, and you can press shade outside. I want no quick out routes. I come in the gap right here. You can QB contain if you want to, and you can see he is just bobbled up in the backfield. Now, we're going to uh, wait for them to go into these small sets. We're going to go into the pinch buck oh. So what I would do is press, I will shift to that side, crash out. So bring him right here, and I want to guard this guy. So we're going to let that running back shoot. Now, it's a chance they might streak you, so take your time. Know what your opponent might be able to do. Take them back a couple, and it's all set up. He runs to the edge, we're just gonna go out there and click off, and you can see we make a tackle in the backfield. So, he's in a small formation. We're gonna press, shade out, shade over the top, take a couple seconds, bring him out. You want him to start throwing slants and stuff because you can adjust to that. Throw slants, I want you to. So here we go, if he runs to that right, we can shoot that gap over there and click off, there's a pitch. Get him to the outside, click off, make him go back to the inside. That is how you keep your opponent from instead of busting for a 40, 50 yard gain, he has 12, 15, maybe 20 yards on five or six carries. That's more realistic and that's what you want to be successful. Come outside right here, we're gonna go to the spotlight, make everybody aggressive on him, and I'm watching this tight end. You can bring him back a couple steps. Always keep that in the back of your head. And here we go. We know that it's a ruin setup. There he is with the trap, and he gets a loss of yardage. If y'all need more help or another video on stretches, traps or anything like that drop a like on the video let me know in the comment section and i'll cook that up for y'all